Is this video of a woman being attacked by an aquarium shark for real? Or is this just another special effects prank video? I've got the answer to that Shark Tank riddle, plus real or fake verdicts on a whole bunch of other photos and videos that you guys sent in. But hey, before we get started today, I just want to let you know this video is sponsored by SellMeGiftCards.com, a really cool service that lets you convert your Amazon gift cards into good old cash. Let's say you win an Amazon gift card here on Bill's channel, but you don't want to buy anything with it, you just want to exchange it for cash. All you got to do is go to www.sellmegiftcard.com, fill in your information, and presto, they put cash in your PayPal account. It's the easiest way to exchange Amazon gift cards for cash, and there are several sales options depending on how fast you want to get paid. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a link for sellmegiftcard.com down here in the description box, along with a special Bill's Channel code that will get you 2% off your transfer fees. This code expires on December 25th, 2017, so make sure you head over there as soon as you can. And don't forget, they only accept Amazon gift cards right now. Now about all those crazy photos and videos that you guys have been sending in. Like this picture of a strange beast that looks like some kind of Dr. Seuss character, a picture claiming to show a planet made of diamonds, a photo of what appears to be a robot dinosaur working the front desk of a hotel, and that doesn't even include the big story this week about a video claiming a giant asteroid is heading towards Earth and will end life as we know it. Is there any chance this could be true? Hey guys, Bill here. You know, we all encounter problems as we go through life, but as you've probably noticed by now, some problems are a lot bigger than others. Like for instance, the dog eating your homework is definitely a problem, but that's nothing compared to let's say, a hurricane hitting your island and now you don't have a house anymore. But what about really, really, really big problems? Like maybe a giant asteroid slamming into the earth and causing tsunamis earthquakes, fires, and general mass destruction all over the planet. Well, that's what this video says is going to happen. It's called Super Tsunami and Asteroid Will Attack Earth 2017 slash 2018. It was submitted by Gamer Whale who said, Bill, can you find out if this is real? Well, Gamer Whale, if the Earth is about to be hit by a giant asteroid, we are all in for a world of hurt. So we better get to the bottom of this and find out what's really going on. Asteroids, in case you don't know, are hunks of rock flying through space. Some are really big and others are pretty small. But it doesn't have to be that big to cause huge problems right here on Earth. Many people believe the dinosaurs went extinct when a giant asteroid hit the Earth about 66 million years ago. Now, if another one hit the Earth today, it could mean the end of the human race, which obviously is not good. A closer look at the video reveals quite a few intriguing details. It was posted in March of 2017 by a channel called News and Conspiracy. The video is a hodgepodge of information, but its main claim is that there's a new asteroid belt that's been discovered, and it's hurling itself into our part of the solar system. The video then goes on to claim this global killer could collide with Earth as soon as 2020, causing a huge tsunami tidal wave and wiping out life as we know it. Hey, wait a minute. The title says 2017 or 2018, and now inside the video it says 2020. I mean, come on, guys. I mean, first of all, I really don't like predictions to start with, but when you give me a prediction where you can't even keep the dates straight, I mean, what am I supposed to think? I was ready to dump this one in the so fake it's funny bin, but just to make sure, I double checked the information, and that's when I made a very scary discovery. According to NASA, there's over a half million known asteroids out there. Luckily, most of them will never come near Earth, but there is one that could actually hit us. It's called Bennu, and this mean-looking lump of space rock is orbiting around our sun. Every six years, it passes the Earth, and due to its constantly changing course, the chances it could hit the Earth is a real possibility. Huh. 
Now that really makes me wonder, I mean, is Bennu part of this asteroid belt that the News and Conspiracy video is talking about? Or is it something completely different? Well, the answer to that, my friends, happens to be right here, the old official envelope. But you've probably watched this show before, and if you have, you know there's no way I'm gonna tell you what's going on in here until you tell me what you got going on up there, okay? Now, when I say go, what I want you to do is yell out as loud as you can, either real or fake. Now, if you can't do that, it's okay to pause the video, go to the comment section, leave your answer there, and then come back here and play the rest of the video to see if you're right or not. A third way to go, uh-huh, is just to vote right up there. You ready? And go. Okay, did you vote? Good, because in just a few seconds, I'm gonna be opening the old official envelope right here. But since we got a little time before that asteroid hits, I just wanna go over a couple other photos and videos that you guys sent in. First up is this photo of what looks like some weird kind of mystery creature. It was submitted by Dav276 who asked, hey Bill, is this picture real? Well, Dav276, I gotta tell you, personally, I'm going with Photoshop, and it's probably two animals that were morphed together, and one of them is definitely a dog. But how did the rest of you guys do out there? Did you vote real, or did you vote fake? Well, if you voted real, I have to tell you, you're a really smart person, because that's right. As Facebook reader Isaac Sisson points out, this is a manatee. It's a gentle sea creature, also called a sea cow. This picture, taken by Guliame Suvant, is of a baby manatee at the zoological park of Beauval in France, just 11 days after its birth. Well, there you go, but I gotta tell you, I feel a little bit stupid because, I mean, I should know what manatees look like. I just made a video with Mermaid Melissa where we both went swimming with manatees. It's a really cool video, so if you wanna check it out, link's down there. Next up is this photo sent in by Silvia Caballero who wrote, my son wants to know if this picture is real and if there really is a planet made out of diamonds. Well, Sylvia, you can tell your son he might consider a career in space mining because guess what? That planet is real. On the other hand, if you did vote real, you're only half right because the picture is fake. As Facebook readers Kent Hung and Isaac Sisson pointed out, this planet is called 55 Cancri E. Some scientists believe one third of it is made out of diamonds. And considering the planet is about nine times the size of Earth, that means there could be the equivalent of three Earths worth of diamonds on just this one planet. That's pretty cool, but it's gonna take a lot of gas to get there. It's actually 40 million light years away. Our final mystery today concerns this surreal photo of a robot dinosaur actually working the front desk of a hotel. It was sent in by Walter Will who asked, is this for real or just some kind of joke photo? Well, Walter, if you ever find yourself traveling in Japan, you might want to spend a night at the Henna Na Hotel where a robot dinosaur actually checks you in, making this photo real. The Henna Hotel is Japan's second robot-run hotel and is filled with all sorts of robots to take care of you. From a trolley bellman to a cute Pokemon-like room assistant, the service is all automated. I just hope they don't use the Terminator to clean the rooms, if you know what I mean. Okay, now that we got all that out of the way, what do you say we get back to something a little more serious here and find out if an asteroid really is headed towards our little planet? Because if it is, we better get Bruce Willis and the boys out there. Get them out on some rockets with nuke weapons. See if we can push that thing off course. All right, here we go. The videos claim that a giant killer asteroid is on track to collide with Earth and cause a mega tsunami has been carefully examined. Based on an analysis of all the material available to us online and through other sources, we have reached a decision. And the decision is, are you ready for this? Without a doubt and beyond any question. So, so fake! fake.
It's funny! Phew, man, I'm glad that didn't turn out to be real because I literally feel like I just dodged a bullet. But you know what? I gotta confess, I did have kind of a funny thought. And that is, if the asteroid turned out that it really was coming here, I could have maxed out my credit cards because I would have never had to pay them off. I mean, how cool would have that been? Wow, that's cool, man. Coming up next is the answer to the video showing that woman getting attacked by a shark in an aquarium. But first, I got some unbelievably interesting details on how we proved that video to be a fake, and you do not want to miss this. Listen. Although it's certainly possible that an asteroid could slam into the Earth at some time in the future, there is nothing in this video connected to any real possibilities. First off, there has been no discovery of an asteroid belt. That part was just made up. The only real threat we know about is from Bennu, and NASA says there's only a 1 in 2700 chance of it hitting us 200 years from now. That leaves a zero chance for 2018 or 2020. But kids, hey, bottom line, do me a favor, okay? Continue to do your homework because guess what? We're all gonna still be here when your report card comes out, okay? Okay. All right. Well, that's all the time I have for this video. I want to thank all you guys for sending in all those crazy photos and videos you send in every week. Also want to send a special thanks to you wonderful people who helped me solve these little mysteries. And hey, don't forget, if you've got a picture or a video and you're not quite sure whether it's real or not, send it in to me at billschannel at gmail.com and I'll take a look. Please don't leave links or suggestions in the comment section because the only thing that's going to do is turn me into a comment and make me go completely crazy! See you next time. Now, about that video of the aquarium shark attack. The original post of the video says the woman was attacked by a shark and left no other explanation of the event. What the poster did not explain is the fact that the shark is part of an exhibit at the Spy Museum in Washington, D.C. The shark and the crack in the glass are just video effects to keep you amused.